What's up, YouTube? How's it growing, eh? It's OG Scotty B Lynx. What? Honestly, it's just, it's basically OG Scotty B. And, uh, because I just think that it sounds cool, OG Scotty B. I just thought that sounded cool because, like, my name's Scotty, so. And, uh, but, uh, there was already some guy that already figured that out on YouTube. So there, yeah, so I put links down, the OG Scotty B links, but I didn't write it properly. So that's why people say blanks to stoner review. Like the stoner review is just what I do. I'm a stoner and I review shit. So that's, so it's just OG Scotty B links. That's how it is. It's just OG Scotty B links. And I, per, it's just OG Scotty, just, or just Scotty really. So you don't have to put the OG there old goat or old guy it's definitely not original gangster because i'm not really about the gang shit but it just it's a good fucking uh, it's, a, it's a good uh set of letters anyways um yeah dvl exotics thank you your i like um your points have been great thank you very much uh, i do like i like reading the comments i do it's they're fun i get up in the morning lorraine's sleeping Usually I get up before, I go out, I smoke my joint and come have a smoke or whatever and I just kind of check out my YouTube comments and stuff and I, I, get, I get a kick out of it. Um, Jesus Freak, I hope you get, don't, you know, I hope you, you know, find a place or whatever. Um, just in case, any promotions and modern jazz, thank you guys, you've been rocking with me for a bit. I thank you all and you're leaving comments and that's what I want I will I like I that's the thing I like about YouTube man is you can interact and I can't wait to go live like I mean I guess I can each time I try though I'm not patient enough to sit there and wait for fucking people to come on really and I just I kind of just want to do it the natural way I mean I'll try Streamlab in a bit but so far I haven't really had any luck with the live thing it's just like I'm such a fucking moron when it comes to this computer shit man I need a guy in the chair that's what I need, you know. Anyways, uh, what's his name? So Steve Rogel, you can go, you can suck my fucking dick with your racist fucking goof comments and go fuck right off. How's that, you piece of shit? Like, yeah, and, and I'll tell you, yes, I'm gonna clickbait and yes, I'm gonna fucking, uh, troll a bit. I haven't been, uh, I started my YouTube channel from the ground up, man, with no subscribers, okay? I didn't fucking go on an already established show and boom, all of a sudden get 5,000 subscribers handed to me. That didn't happen to me. So I'm going to fucking, you know, dodge and weave and I'm going to use some of the meme print and I'm going to fucking do some clickbait on my own. I'm going to do a few things. Um... So go fuck yourself if you don't like what I'm saying or whatever. Because I'm just trying to just drop some shit and some stories and talk shit. So if you don't want to hear me talk shit, go fucking listen to some other, some other, buddy, some other person talk shit. Because I'm not going to read your shit talking. <laughs> whatever. Anyway, so yeah, fuck you. Um, but other than that, uh, J-Rock, uh, shout out J-Rock. You put a fucking video on the other day. I don't know if anyone saw it. He was trying to paint. I was, I was laughing my head off. But, I mean, I'm sure he'd laugh his head off if I tried to fucking, you know, breed dogs, right? Like, I, I don't know shit about that. But fucking watch a fucking YouTube video there, J-Rock. Fuck five minutes, man. You, you know. You, you know like, you know what to do. Anyways, I think I might make a J-Rock fucking painting video. Because it looks like you got some painting to do. So, you might as well learn how to do it, right? I mean... Anyone can do it. It's it's not it's not it's hard to be as good as I am at painting because I'm actually probably one of Canada's very best uh, interior and exterior painters, residential painters. I'm probably one of the best in Canada, guaranteed. I'm fucking amazing when it comes to painting. I'm fearless on ladders and scaffolding and all that kind of sh shit. You know, lately though, now I'm fucking, like, I'm, I'm 50 next year, man. I'm 50 in June. I don't look it. I know, I know I only look like 30, but I'm 50. But, uh, and I drink, and I like to drink my beers after work, which I gotta actually, I gotta slow that shit down. I really do. It costs so much fucking money. But, uh, so I don't like going up the ladders anymore. I mean, I still can do it. I just would rather not. I'll send the young kids up now. 
because I'm a foreman. But if they can't do it or they're scared, I'll run up there and show the little fucking punks how to fucking paint. Um, let's see, uh, what else is we going to talk about? Yeah, this is just more of a fucking talking shit, uh, video, uh, oh, um, oh yeah, fucking, there's some more news here, uh, in the paints trying to go through YouTube to get for, uh, harassment. He's saying people harassed him or some shit. Anyways, check, check out Maple Scissor if you got a little thing about that, man. I think it'll, yeah, check out that. So in the paints trying to fucking, but under, under the, under the guise of Mountain View, I think. He's trying to go on saying he was bullied, YouTube bullied. Fuck you, man. You went out and you just went off on all these guys, man. These, you know, okay, like, Jake, um, J-Rock, no, Jake, the Florida guys, Jake, Pino, and Frog, they're kind of Hollywood and that, but that's how, I guess, that's how Florida cats are, I guess, you know, they're kind of flashy. So fuck whatever, but, you know, and some of the stuff's a little gang-related, this and that, but, you know, something, the guys are pretty good characters, actually, I, I think they'd be cool guys to chill with, really, you know what I mean, um, to be, like, quite honest, I mean, I think Pino and Frog would be way more fun than Jake, though, honestly, I think Jake would be, I think Jake's a little too serious, but, uh, but yeah, I might do a retake on, because I, I might do a retake on how they, because I was kind of watching him, and I said he was like, he had some boss, Kennedy's, ten, I said he was kind of like a boss or a king, he must have been a king or something back in the day, but I don't know, I think he might, I think there might be more to it, um, I think he reads his stuff, I think he writes his stories out before he tells them, so he puts his dramatic flair in there, which, which, you know, I guess that's smart, and I think he, uh, yeah, I think, I, I, I don't know, I think, you know, his whole, how much money did you throw back to your homies in jail fucking type thing, I, I mean, I don't know, I don't, I think, I think there might be more to that, I think, but whatever, it's just, like I said, I think fucking 23 and 1 is a CIA agent, so, you know, don't always fucking go by what I think. Anyways, just, uh, I don't even know what I'm going to call this fucking piece of shit. So, uh, thanks for watching. It's, uh, enjoy, um, your day. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to. I can't fucking, I'm too stoned to even finish this joint right now. So, anyways, thanks. See you later. And, uh, how's it going, anybody?